Hi everyone, my name is Martina Nelson. I'm the Livestock Specialist for Ontario. Today I want to talk about staging our corn for silage harvest. So what you want to do is you want to go in your fields, grab nice representative cobs of um, your silage fields, and we're going to take a look at where the milk line is. So to do that, you use the top part of the ear, and then you look. I use my fingernail, you can use your teeth, doesn't matter. And you start from the bottom up and you bite or you squeeze until it goes from soft and milky to hard. And where it gets hard, that's our starch line. And so that tells us how far along we're going. So you, or we are. So you can see using this chart here, depending on how far along our kernels are. So in this case, we're about almost at half, at uh, a quarter milk line. So we can see this is how many days we are away from it reaching half milk line. Half milk line is the minimum that we want our corn to reach before we start taking it off for silage. So you can see we're in between this late milk dough, early dent stage. And so I picked a very early hybrid in this case. Um, so we're about 15 days away from this corn reaching half milk line. Once we reach half milk line, and half milk line would be that halfway up the kernel is where we reach that hard, hard spot. Once it's half milk line, then we want to start testing our whole plant moisture. We test the whole plant moisture and then based off what kind of storage structure you have, you know that's when it's going to be time to harvest. So some tips to keep in mind, we're going to gain about one half a point to a point of starch a day and we're going to actually dry down the crop about half a point to a point a day. On nice sunny warm windy days, we'll, we'll drop a whole point if it's not as warm or even rain of course we're not going to drop any any points so just some rough guidelines you can use to help you guys figure out when we're going to be chopping corn